Hey guys, welcome back to Cryptalina channel. In this video, I go into more detail about the correct use of the Fibonacci retracement indicator. The Fibonacci retracement is a powerful indicator that indicates when a pullback may be coming to the end. However, almost all people use this indicator incorrectly, but you will know how to use the Fibonacci correctly at the end of this video. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe to my free Telegram group, where you can find all my last uh, crypto trades for free. And also guys, don't forget to claim your personal 4500 dollars bonus on Bybit. All you need to do is make your first registration on Bybit and make your first deposit. And if Bybit don't work in your country, you can use BitJet because if you register on my link, you can also get $8,500 bonus. All the necessary link will be in the description and in the first pinned comment. So let's get started. This video is sponsored by AAFX Company. AAFX Company is an online forex broker with its headquarters in Athens that claims to be regulated in Europe and offers an exceptional trading experience with outstanding customer support. The wide offering covers the high level of leverage, constantly updated offering of trading instruments with recently included Bitcoin and with possibilities to auto trade or use industry leading meta trader form. If you want to try my strategies and trade on them and are looking for a forex broker, then I can recommend you AAFX. All the necessary links will be in the description. Also, by registering on my link, you will get a nice welcome bonus. In this video, I will first give you the basic explanation of the Fibonacci indicator. It's namely important that you understand this indicator well before you are going to get started with it. After the basic explanation, we will go deeper into experienced trading strategies with this indicator, which are only used by pro traders. The Fibonacci indicator is well known indicator used by many people. The indicator is derived from the Fibonacci lens that you find everywhere in the universe. You can find this lens in galaxies, shells, trees, but also in the human body. This lens represents an organic growth that is the same in almost every object in this world. Also, on the price of a stock quote, you can find Fibonacci lens by using the Fibonacci indicator by means of simple lines which represent growth percentages traders can chart important support and resistant areas. If you have been trading for any length of time, you know that a stock price never goes up in a straight line, it always moves in a zigzag. The purpose of the Fibonacci indicator is that you can start predicting the bottom of such a zigzag. However, the biggest problem with most traders is the fact that they don't know which Fibonacci level the price is making a pullback. They use every line available on the indicator thinking they can predict the exact bottom, but let me give you some advice. Stop doing that. The only level you need is the 0.786 level. We only want to have the most important level on our indicator, so before I explain the Fibonacci, first go to the settings of this indicator and tick only the 0.786 level. In addition to the 0.786 level, you will of course also need the 1 and 0 levels. Once you have checked this making the color of the 0.786 level green, we do this so we can easily distinguish this level. Your indicator should now look like this. Using the Fibonacci takes some experience, however, when you understand how to pull it off, you will benefit greatly from. It in simply words, the price must first have a low point and then a high point in order to be able to extend the Fibonacci. Here we see an example on the price. The price first makes a low point and then it rises up. Once we see that we can draw out the Fibonacci from the low point to the high point, this looks like this. I now draw the lines of the Fibonacci a little to the right and you can see that the green line is hanging below the price. All we have to do now is wait for the price to fall towards this green line. 
We want to see the price fall because then we can make money when it rises again afterwards. We always want to buy the price as low as possible and we can do that by using the 0.786 level. Now that the price has fallen towards this level, you can do several things. The most simple strategy is simply to open a position as soon as the price hits this level. I will show you that first. As soon as the price hits the green level, you open the position and put the stop loss below the last low. Then you set the target towards the top of the Fibonacci. You see that with this I now obtain a risk reward ratio. This is the simplest way you can trade with the Fibonacci indicator. However, if you want to look for several confirmations, then you could use the moving average 50, 100 or 200. The moving average also counts as a support level. And if this exactly coincides with the 0.786 level of the Fibonacci, then this is seen as a double support level from which the price could start to rise rapidly. Again, I open my position on the 0.786 level and I put my stop loss below the last low. Subsequently, I again achieve an ample risk reward ratio of 3 when I pay out the position at the top of the Fibonacci and this is exactly the point where you as a regular trader can distinguish yourself and develop into a professional trader. I professional trader always looks for multiple confirmation and don't get me wrong about the 0.786 level, the 0.50 or the 0.32 level can also work. However, I always want the price as low as possible to buy a position. If the price makes a relatively large pullback, I earn more at the time. When the price starts to rise again, this way you sometimes have to wait longer than for a pullback towards the 0.50 level, but the profits will be bigger. Of course, you are free to use the information from this video for another Fibonacci level. Let's make the Fibonacci strategy a little more professional. I have a question for you. Do you already have a place where you trade in crypto? If not, I can recommend you Bybit. Bybit is a crypto exchange aimed at experienced crypto day traders. You can use a professional trading interface where you can day trade in over 100 different cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, Ethereum. In addition, the leverage feature is one of the biggest reasons why people trade on Bybit. This is because leverage is a feature where you can make your position size worth up to 100 times more. This allows your position to grow 100 times faster in profit or loss. But this leverage you can earn when the market is rising as both when the market is falling. Obviously, this is professional function and you shouldn't use it if you are not experienced. However, you can try it out with a small amount of capital or the free $3,000 bonus you receive when you sign up through the link in the description. You can also use a for price layout within a Bybit. This way you can easily keep an eye on multiple prices. Very convenient if you're a real day trader. If you're not sure yet if you want to trade on this exchange, feel free to look around and only claim the free bonuses. Let's quickly go back to the video. So as you now know, an experienced day trader uses multiple confirmation before opening a position. We have now talked about the most simple strategy where you just open the position when the price hit the 0.786 level and we have talked about adding the moving average to find a double support level. But now we are going to talk about adding price action. We are going to look for real price action support or resistance levels which will end up exactly at the 0.786 level. A support and resistance level can also be characterized as a trend line. As we see here, for example, on the price, we can pull out the Fibonacci in this downtrend. We now see that the price is making a pullback to the 0.786 level, which is also exactly where the 100 moving average lands. But in addition to that, we see something else, namely a trend line resistance. 
We can draw a trend line from this uh, that also lands exactly at the 0 0.786 level. So at this point you have triple resistance. We have the 0 0.786 level itself. Next to it we have the moving average and next to it another trend line resistance. So this is the ideal place to make a selling position. You see this one obviously close nicely in profit. The point is that you as a trader should always be able to find as many advantages for yourself as possible. The more advantages you have, the bigger the chance that the position will succeed. Let's look at another example. Here on the course we see a clear low followed uh, by a clear high so we can pull out the Fibonacci. Once we've done that, we see in this case that the 200 moving average also ends up at the 0 0.786 level. In addition, we see another support level, which also lands exactly on the 0 0.686 level. So here too, we can open a position with three confirmations. You can see that this position gives a lower risk reward ratio than the other positions. It differs with every position. You can choose to place the stop loss below the 0 0.786 level to increase the risk reward ratio. However, I would only do this if you have at least three confirmations. You see that the risk reward ratio now shoots up. What you can also do is add the three moving average indicators at the same time on the price. As you can see here, I've added a 50, 100 and 200 moving average indicators, all three. And this way you can easily see which moving average will end up at the 0 0.786 level. On the left side of the screen, we see the first high point followed by the first low point. So we can pull out the Fibonacci here. However, what we see here is that the price is not making a pullback towards jet 0.786 level. Instead, it's already making a new low point. So we need to pull out the Fibonacci again. In this example, the price does make a pullback towards the 0.786 level. We also see the price is ending up on the 200 moving average. In addition to this, we see a trend line resistance and also a horizontal resistance. We now have a quadruple resistance. Of course, we open our positions here. This position gives us a risk reward ratio of over 5. Then we see that the price makes a new low again. So we can once again pull out the Fibonacci. Again, price comes back to the 0 0.786 level and the 200 moving average. In addition, we still have the same trend line as just now. Possibly you could even say that there is also a half horizontal resistance level. So we open our position here again. You can of course choose whether to place the stop loss above the last high or above the 0 0.786 level. In both cases, the position close excellent in profit. If you trade exactly this way and always make sure that you can find several confirmations before opening a position, then I can assure you that you will trade like a pro and earn like the top 1% traders do. I want to thank you for watching this video and I look forward to see you next time. It's all for now. Bye.